Hey guys, it's your Marker and welcome back to my channel. Well, today's video is going to show you a quick demonstration on how I turned this beautiful curio into my martini tower. Yes, I turned this beautiful brown oak curio that I got from the Goodwill. It is by Pulaski Furniture and is retail for about five to seven hundred dollars. So I didn't want the oak. Of course, that is not my color theme. So what I did was blinged it out. I stained it black. So I add some bling and embellishments on it. So I bling the shelf as well as the top and the bottom of the cabinet just to give it an extra pop. And I also bling out my other furniture. So I got it to match so it could look like it's cohesive. This here is from Ikea. This one here I got from years ago. And I also had the piece from Walmart. So I bling out all my furniture once I paint it black just to give a nice dazzling effect. All right, guys, let me show you what I did to make this cabinet pop. All right, let's get started. The first thing I had to do was take the back off of the curio and I just used it with um, a knees and nose plier and I used just a regular butter knife just to loosen it up. Once everything, all the staples was removed, the only thing I had to do was slide the board out of the way and then I was, and then I saw the mirrors. I'm glad it was two mirrors instead of one because it would be easier to work with and to remove. Once the mirrors was removed, I was able to get to the curio from the inside. So I started on the inside first Once the staples was removed, I used a deglosser to degloss the shine off of the polyurethane. Now it was time to stain, so I used the stain and poly by Verifine, and I used the espresso initially, but as you can see here, it didn't coat it enough for me. I could still see through the oak. So then I switched it up to the black satin, and with that, I was able to just do one coating and it covered the whole thing, so I went with that. After I finished painting it, I just put it back up against the wall where it was going to be and I feel so it looks really good, very traditional, but I wanted a little bit more pizzazz, a little bit more embellishments and I wanted to pop even more. So it was time to embellish. All right guys, let me show you how I did it. What I'll be using is the glass tiles and the glass tiles is only at Home Depot. I don't think Lowe sell this shelf I also got from Home Depot, but the PL530 is either or store, but I did pick this up at Lowe's. Basically here, I'm just pulling the tiles from the backing. And once I pull it out, I'm trying to make a pattern of which way I want this to go. So I'll pull like some long ones, medium ones, one from each side. Then I'll pull a couple of the chrome ones. And then whatever pattern that you want to use, it's fine. It, you can't really go wrong with them. But you see how it is to tile is together. Just try to make some type of pattern so it can look interesting. And here I am scraping because sometimes when you pull it off, you have the backing comes off with it. So then I just use the X-Acto blade and just sort of cut it so you won't see any of the edging.
once I have my pattern down, now it's time to apply the adhesive. So it's easier to do it before you apply any type of glue. You could probably use E6000. I just used what I had here. Once you have the tile on and it's dry, you can now stop here or add just a little sparkle. Okay guys, let's bling the rest of this out. For the curio, you're going to repeat the same process. You're just going to bring the other tile in the side so you can wrap it around the front and the both sides, top and bottom. All right, guys, after that, it's time to get some shelving. It did not have shelving with this. That's the only downfall, but that's what happens when you go to Goodwill. So I reached out to a glass company here in Las Vegas. They were so awesome. They were awesome sauce, Academy class. They were so cheap. Everyone wanted for four sheets of glass that is a quarter inch thick. They wanted $120 and 240 for tempered. So I got regular glass from them and it was $13 per shelf. So it was awesome. And I told them I would give them a shout out. Okay guys, this concludes this video on how I did my curio, my black and my bling. Guys, remember, black and bling. Alright guys, it's your more girl. Thanks for watching this video. If you have any comments or questions, just don't hesitate. Always put it in the comment section. And don't forget what we always say, like, comment, and subscribe. Alright guys, it's your more girl.